Hello folks, this is 2019 May June paper 1 3 and the question number is 11. So this question is concerned with uh, the chapter of uh, forces and uh, we can uh, consider it as uh, vectors as well because it deals with vectors, it deals with uh, uh, the angles uh, of the application of forces. So it says that a picture is suspended from a nail, from a nail by a single cord, single cord connected to two points X and Y on the picture, on the picture. There is negligible friction between the cord and the nail here, yeah? so the tension in both sides of the cord is same. So here it's the same tension force here. So I can say at point X the tension is force is in this direction, T, and at point Y the tension force is in this direction. So it is so both of them are T and T. Uh, the tension in the cord is T. The angle between the cord and the vertical is uh, theta on both sides. So theta on both sides. So which statement is correct here? So here what happens? Uh, what I have is uh, this tension has a component here which is a t cos theta so here it will be equal to t cos of theta since so this is angle theta here also the component will be equal to t cos of theta so the total force upward will be equal to uh, t cos theta plus t cos theta equal to 2t cos of theta theta and uh, since uh, this thing is in a uh, at rest it means that uh, this force upward is equal to the weight of the body so that means 2t cos theta should be equal to the weight now let us go through the choices to see whether this is one of the conditions uh, in that sense uh, I think I should uh, try from the last one it says that the weight of the picture is equal to t cos theta the weight of the picture is equal to t cos theta so, but here we have got weight equal to t cos theta so this thing disqualifies in the very beginning because I my, my eyes went to choice uh, the last choice uh, after I got this formula so from here uh, let, let's read here so moving points x and y to the top edge so we move x and y to the top edge while keeping the distance apart distance apart and the length of the cord constant length of cord also constant would reduce the tension in the cord so it says that if we move this we move this if uh, the length of cord is same and this is also same uh, it says that uh, the tension uh, would reduce in the cord so this thing is uh, not possible it's not possible because what happens is if I move it like this for example like this here like this here and the tension of uh, the length of the cord also same it means that uh, to to make uh, it happen to make the length of the cord same this point also must shift like this this point also must shift like this so length of the cord same and distance also same so this goes here so it is just like uh, like uh, this whole setup has gone just like this no change in angles whatsoever so that's why that's why it will not change it will not perform any change in the tension so this also disqualifies so next is moving points x and y for the apart on the picture apart on the picture so this x and y goes here while keeping the length of the cord uh, constant so length is same length is same but uh, x and y apart so for that to happen if this goes in this way it must come down it must come down uh, it must come down and it says this will reduce the tension in the cord so if it comes down theta will increase if this thing comes down theta will increase so if theta increases what happens here is let's do the form like this t is equal to w by 2 cos of theta so if theta increases cos theta decreases and if cos theta decreases then t should increase if theta increases cos theta decreases because uh, in case of cos theta it is uh, uh, the value 1 at 0 degree and uh, 0 at uh, 90 degrees so when angle increases cos theta decreases so cos theta decreases means t will increase but uh, the choice says would reduce the tension in the core so this thing also is incorrect now the only remaining is the first one it says that increase the length of the cord length of the cord with points x and y in the same place x and y same place length of cord is increased like this like this uh, would reduce the tension in the core so if I make the length like this like this theta will decrease so like now theta here if I make it like this theta will be just like this it decrease so if theta decreases cos theta will increase will increase and t will decrease so if theta increases cos theta will increase and t will decrease so that means that that, that in choice number a also it says that uh, this, this is doing this 
would reduce the tension in the course. That's why choice number A should be the correct answer.